Okay, so the last test I showed was testing my chlorine, and I was at about 3.5. So I'm going to go ahead and add bleach and show you how I do that. There is an app you can download called Pull Pal, I recommend. It's real good. You can go in and configure how many gallons of pool your water has. You can put how much your chlorine test said it was, what you want your chlorine to go to. If you're using bleach, 6% uh, bleach, all that, and it will automatically figure it for you. Uh, once you kind of get the gist of it, you will know that if you have a 15,000 gallon pool, 15 ounces takes it to 0.5, or 30 ounces of bleach will already one chlorine parts per million. So, what we want to do is simply get a measuring cup and cheap bleach. Okay. I'm going to pour in, and as you can see, 16 ounces. I'm going to just slowly pour that into the pool. Might be good to put it towards your return, and then your return will go ahead and push it on through the pool. I'm not doing that right now. That's normally what I do. Okay, that would raise it about 0.5. So my chlorine should be at 4.0. So about another 15. That should raise it to about 4.5. And this one's going to raise it right around 5. It's going to be your preference, what works well for you. I test my pool nightly, or in the evening, generally as the sun goes down, or after the sun goes down. Make sure your pump's running for 30 minutes or so after you put it in. I keep mine at a maximum of 5, and then it'll burn off anywhere from 1 to 2 over the next day, 24 hours, sometimes on a very sunny and hot day, maybe a little more. Then you just add the amount you need to get it back to five or whatever your maximum is and your pool will stay completely clear if you use those steps that's adding bleach to your cool to your pool using the bleach system thank you for watching